What is up, everybody? Welcome. Okay, that's enough. <laughs> Welcome to the Binding of Isaac. Afterbirth plus. Um, have I even done the daily today? Let me make sure there's no... Oh, you son of a bitch, broken modem. You might be saying, hey, Jay, why are you running broken modem mod? Well, I had to download it because I wanted uh, the broken modem art. Because when you unpackage Isaac, it does, it didn't unpackage, you know, the booster packs that just dropped. Okay, there's no mods on. We're doing the daily to see if we get the, the freaking achievement. And no luck. Okay, we're just going to go in here and die. And we're going to continue on our with our uh, Eden streak. Bruh. I'm a dead bird. Dead bird, why'd you do it? All right. Well, that's that. That is that. Like I said, we're going to continue with our Eden streak today. What is up, everybody? Hope you're all having a good one. Um, it's late. It's late as shit tonight. I'm a little nervous. Look at us, dude. We look like Frankenstein or some shit. What the hell? <laughs> okay, well, we got cancer, I believe that is. And then we got uh, Pandora's box. We got an Elvis type messy haircut looking thing. We look insane. We look awesome. Um, let's go see what we have the item item room here. Um, oh man, these are both. Well, not both good. Uh, that's not dead eye. I think pinging shears is a is a no brainer here. The only problem is we're gonna be leaving Pandora's box. You know what? I'm gonna make the executive decision right now and just pop it right here. Pop it right here. Two soul hearts. It is what it is. We have, you know, if you take that into into account, we have an amazing starting health. Like, an amazing starting health. Um, but, yeah. This is very late. So, I'm a little concerned about my Isaac play. I actually streamed. Sorry, I had to turn on the fan. I actually streamed for, like, five hours playing Player Unknown's Battlegrounds. And showered eight. And now I'm like playing Isaac again. So it feels weird to sit down back down at the computer. It's usually the end of the night for me. But tomorrow I got some things I have to do. Some some adult things, some very important things. I have to go uh <clears throat> check out a condo. A condo I might be looking not to rent, but to buy, actually, which is kind of freaking exciting. Um so yeah, I gotta do that tomorrow in the morning, so I don't really have time to do a early morning recording sesh, so I got to do a late night recording sesh. Also, I'm going to see Jimmy Fallon tomorrow. Late night with Jimmy Fallon. It's actually not late night with Jimmy Fallon anymore. It's the Tonight Show with Jimmy Fallon. It's been that for years, like th two or three years, uh, maybe even longer. But yeah, I actually used to go see Jimmy Fallon when he was doing the late night show because like they, I mean, they still give away tickets. It's still free, but Back in the day, he wasn't as half as popular as he is now with the Tonight Show, and uh, used to go to a lot of the a uh, lot of the shows because it's in New York City. It's not far. It's like a 50-minute train ride, and uh, it's free. Like I said, so pretty cool. Uh, place one bomb there. We should be golden actually, because we're gonna be able to get these bombs back. We got a half a soul heart as well. Uh, Get a key back, get a key back anyway, on top of the already key back. All right, let's use this pretty fly. All right, things are doing things are doing good. We're actually gonna go to the uh, curse room. But yeah, I wanted to keep pinking shears. I, I Pandora's box is, is good, but we're actually gonna full card. Let's conserve all the health we can. Why not? Stack it up. Stack it up, baby. Um, But yeah, I, I mean, Pandora's box is awesome, right? But... I just think there's not many applications for Pandora's box other than what? The womb one or the cathedral you can get an angel room item on. Um, it's just so it's just so late game that this pinking shears is going to help me out so much in between the time that we'd be holding on to Pandora's box for that. It just didn't seem worth it. It didn't seem worth it. We're doing whatever it takes to get the win, man. That's, that is the, uh, M.O. Let me make sure that, because I, I, you heard that crazy audio effect thing going on. I actually got, like, an effects of voice effects thing for the stream, just because it's fun. Um, 
it's not like I'm going to be using that that often in, in videos or anything. It's just a little fun tool for streaming. But the mic settings and everything kind of got a little flipped upside down. So I hope my mic isn't insanely loud and the, and the game is insanely quiet. I think that's probably the case if I had to tell. But uh, we'll get it figured out on the next video. I promise you that. Oh, come on, dude. We've been doing so good, but... <clears throat> I think, he, I think he knew what I was trying to do there, but <clears throat> I miscalculated that terribly. Uh, I was trying to bait them up into the bomb so I would get the Tinted Rock and the enemies. Two birds, one stone, but yeah, it didn't work out. Okay, speaking of stone, we got a small rock. Let's go, baby. Let's go. We also... I was going to say, we also got caffeine pills, so we have, like, more speed than we're used to. All right, it's okay. We've been taking some dumb damage, but we also had a ton of health. We also have pinking shears ready to go for the boss, so it shouldn't be an issue. And we also have our freaking item room and shop right here. There's a coin and a key. Actually, pa parastoid? I never actually said that, but egg tears are great. I love egg tears. Some of my favorite items in the game. Do we want, do we want sack? <sighs> well, I don't know if it's even going to be possible. We can wait. We can wait. Let's go fight the boss. Oh my. Oh, see, I, I had to give you the disclaimer that it is late night and uh, I might be a little bit off my game, but not to worry. We will hold up the Eden streak. We will hold it up. Believe. I mean, that little horn was going way too fast for his own good. Uh, little brim, I think is worth it. Honestly, I could have maybe taken the, I don't know how many red hearts I have. I really don't. I want to say I have three. So it was, it, it wasn't like I could swindle that deal for free. Uh, the one heart deal. I think it was my shadow. Uh, but little Brim's going to be awesome, especially early game here. He can carry. He's actually are only familiar right now and little brim being your first familiar is the best case scenario because the later you get him the further down the line he goes and the harder he is to line up so very good situation right now we find ourselves in this run has just been good straight off the bat honestly i mean pinking shears i think is top three or four best space bar items in the game like not even close no contest uh, and then we got Pandora's box that gave us two extra soul hearts and we had a cancer start with which an amazing amount of HP. And we have now, since picking up small rock, a 4.51 damage stat. And now we have egg tears as well with little brim. So this might be one of the earliest ever that I would call a win, but it's, it's especially now a sack boy taking care of probably most, if not all of our consumable problems. We look insane right now. What the hell? What the hell, dude? Um, yeah, we're in a really good position. Like I said, this is this is a weird time to call a win. It's not like we picked up Brimstone or Mom's Knife or anything, but I just think we have so many good things working for us that it, it would be hard to throw. I mean, I've thrown runs in the past, so you never know. Uh, just this one would be difficult to mess up, and uh, I feel good about it. I feel real good about it. Let's check out our item. <clears throat> I mean, this could throw a wrench in the whole system. Why even mess with it? Why even mess with it? We don't have a syringe. It's just, it doesn't seem super worth it. A 4.5 damage stat, I feel like at this point, probably can only get bad with a shuffled with the shuffled stats. So yeah, let's not risk it. I figured we'd at least try to kill him. <laughs> Not that big of a deal, considering we got a little brim and a uh, little brim. Any kind of penetrative shot murders those dudes with multiple hit boxes throughout their body. All right. Oh, I was trying to get that before they left. We did actually get both of them, but. Ooh, baby. Ooh, baby. Uh, pop this. I hope we get more booster pack stuff. I mean, to be real, we kind of did. Like, we got one of the new Eden haircuts, which is awesome. Oh, God. But I would love to get, like, an item out of it. 
Like even like the uh, little delirium would be cool on top of like the little brim already. Buddy in a box, any of those would be sweet. I still don't know what fast bomb is, ba bombs are. Uh, they were done by Edmund, I think. I don't really know the deal with those. Uh, but that would be cool if like every booster pack Edmund kind of threw in his own item or something. That would be sick. Because I'm sure he still thinks of items, you know? I don't think you could shake... <laughs> I don't think he could shake his brain after, you know, five... Four to five years of thinking of Binding of Isaac items. I think it just probably, in his day-to-day, -day, it just comes to him. New, uh, new Isaac items and stuff. So that would be cool if every month he, along with the community, he threw in like one or two of his own items. Even if they were small, like even if they were just like cards or something. All right. Have we gotten our item room? No, I don't think we have. But we do have uh, pinking shears running, so we might as well go pop this. There's no no competition. We'll take uh, another HP up for the deal with the devil on the next floor. Hopefully, we get the deal with the devil on the next floor. There's a good chance at it. So we might as well take the health, get ready for it. Might as well take the battery as well. Um, Curse of the Lost, though. I You guys pointed out. I think it was not last... Maybe it was the last episode or the episode before that. We had like four or five Curse of the Lost. I think I mentioned it in the episode... But I guess I didn't realize how many I actually had, which is, that's that's horrendous luck. Like, actually horrendous luck. Um, oh, it's the good shop. It's the good shop, boys. This is, uh, well, only one luck up? Interesting. The other one turned into a sack. Hmm. Hangman. Sun. Okay, I'll take the sun. Oh, I don't have a bomb. That's really uncomfortable. Um, hangman, fool, sun. All right, we're going to sit and take the sun and move on. Uh, I don't know where our item room is. I am completely lost, courtesy of the curse. We've already seen that. We came down with that. Hopefully, it's to the left here. Hopefully, I remember how to get back to the boss fight. Oh, we already have. I'm so sorry. Oh, it was experimental treatment. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. We're good. We're fine. I'm not stroking out. This is good. This is good, boys. All right. Well, still feel the same as I did at the end of last floor. I still feel like we have this game in hand, and it's ours to lose right now. I think that's a better way to say, oh, this is a one run this early. I think it, it's better to say... You know, this run is, it's ours to lose. Like the game, the game has handed us a win here. What what we do with it is is up to us. It's on us. I mean, the game can hand you a win, but the game can also take away a win. You never know what it could, what it could give us. It could give us a six dice room that re-rolls into like, a, like rubber cement epicac or something, or my reflection epicac. I don't know. Game giveth, the game taketh away. So let's just count our blessings and enjoy this run. Enjoy the ride. I do want to synergize the hell out of this run. Because I think it could use it. A lot of lover. What? What? What are the chances they're all lovers cards? That was pretty bizarre. That was pretty bizarre. I, if I do say so myself. Bloody crown. Why does it? I know this is one of the new ones. I just, I, for some reason, can't pinpoint what it does. But I've, I've, I've looked it up before. I'm like 95% sure I've looked it up before. Tried to pinking shears there, and it actually didn't really work out. That was an amazing little brim play. Check out the shop. Oh, buddy. <laughs> Do we do it? Do we do it? The Crooked Penny. I do love me some Crooked Penny, but have we done enough Crooked Penny? I don't know. Is there ever enough Crooked Penny? It's just so damn fun. And now I'm finally getting like semi-okay at using it. Hmm. I mean, Pinking Shears is like the made like made me really confident in saying this was this was ours to lose. So I don't know. This could that could be the first step in us losing it. <laughs> you never know. It's just so much damage, man. It's just, it, pinging shears is nuts. Well, we didn't get a deal with the devil. We whiffed on the 67%, but we did get uh, screw, which is good, because our tier rate could have used some help, and it got some love there. 
which is nice. I am coming up short here. Hmm. So that must be a library of some sort. I don't I don't really remember how many locks was on the door. I don't know what this does. It's is it a random tier effect every two rooms or something? I I remember picking this up in an episode and I kind of just like shrugged it off and then somebody in the comments was like, LOL, Jay shrugs off metronome and, and like on the same day, Edmund tweeted it was like one of his favorite items. So I don't know. Okay, we just got my shadow there. Interesting. Um, I'm, I'm assuming it's a, it's just a rant. It's a random item effect every, every two rooms. So it's a double locked room. Okay, so, well, we could re-roll Metronome. I think I'm gonna re-roll Metronome. Uh, I mean, Crooked Penny, uh, we don't really have enough money for it. I don't really wanna blow up the donation machine. I think we're just gonna st stay the course, man. I think we're just gonna stay the course. Uh, I will re-roll, though, Metronome. I'm, I believe the four room does re-roll pedestals. If I'm not mistaken, and I'm gonna take Bloody Crown because I think it's a good item, or sorry, a good trinket. I'm not exactly sure what it does, but I it feel like it has something to do with maybe item rooms in the womb. I don't really know. I mean, Bookworm Transformation. That's that's one on the on the old belt notch notch on the old belt. There you go, Jay. Spit it out, dude. We know we know we get it. It's nighttime, right? It's nighttime. It's it's not normal Isaac hours for me. <clears throat> All right. Well, not not much has changed, honestly. We got what screw there. That was all that's changed. I mean, you know, we could get to the point where if we don't get much more DPS up, we're gonna be in a in a sticky situation. But let's not let's not think of something so horrendous. I mean, we did just get a DPS up in screw, so. We can't really complain. There's no room to complain. No one's listening. No one cares. Uh, the sun card. Debating when I should use it. I will check this out. Okay. Paid for the entry in here. And we got a coin to boot. I'm all right with it. Get little brim locked and loaded. Um... I was talking about going to see Jimmy Fallon tomorrow in New York City. Uh, I think Jason Sudeikis is gonna be there and then Lily Singh, who I believe is a YouTuber, if I'm not mistaken. She's been on the show numerous times, actually. Um, also, Brian Regan, who is one of my favorite comedians of all time, is actually gonna be on the show, which is pretty cool, man. I know it's not like a real huge... Uh, like set that the the comedy acts get they get like five minutes or something which given brian regan only five minutes is like has to be has to be uh illegal somewhere that's just not even right but i get it it's it's just to promote their tours and stuff uh just a little teaser i'm very excited for that though i'm very excited to see brian regan like i said he's one of my favorite comedians okay just get little brim going there you go. There you go. That's all you need to do. Get a little brim going. Start the engine. So much brimstone. So much brimstone. So little time. Okay. That was handled pretty well. There's a sack up there that I forgot. Unless it was in the middle of the map. It might have been. Might have been in the middle of the map. It's a lot of Zombros. Speaking of sacks, we got a key and a bomb, and we'll go and check out the item room. It's Blank Card Sun. Well, we pick it up, we use it. Now we still have the Sun card, which is dope. Ghost Baby, not super interested. Little Gertie, not interested. My Reflection, not interested. Oddly enough, I will take Mini Mush. I know he's probably not stacked up against some of the other items I skipped, um, but. I, I like I like mini mush. I like the size down. I like the speed up. I know it's not everybody's favorite item. We just got a 
freaking tears up, baby. Tears up. It was an all blue pill. Make a mental note of that. See, mini mush right there. I would never have dodged that first shot. Granted, I botched the second one horrendously, but I would have never dodged that first one. No way in hell. No way, no how. Good old greed. We can actually cheese greed pretty bad here. Before he even knows what's happening, he's gonna die, man. He's gonna die. Little brim. Oh, God. <clears throat> nice. Okay. Four cents and a bomb. Do, 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 do. Hope you guys have been enjoying Battlegrounds on the YouTube. Um, like I said, that episode, I, I, I kind of teased it last, uh, Isaac. I kind of said, like, oh, the one coming up is really good. It was a wild beginning. Watching it back after editing it and uh, getting it finally up. I would love to, to take that. I would love it. But I don't think it's going to happen unless we get a Hangman card, which I've seen. Um, doesn't mean I'm going to see it uh, again anytime soon. I would be very excited if we did, but... I'm excited to go to the city tomorrow, Not let alone, like, Jimmy Fallon. I'm, I haven't been to New York in a while. I think the last time I was there was with my girlfriend in, in December. Maybe? Yeah, I think. I think so. Sorry. Nose itched. Um, okay. Let's go. Necro one. Mini Mush just helping me dodge all this with our small ass hitbox, man. The clutch. The clutch Mini Mush. Uh, we'll wait. Uh, okay. Well. I mean, sure, we'll take Shade as well. I'm not going to take Guppy's head, but touching it is nice. And then we're going to get a little bit more HP back and some damage to boot. And. What else? Nothing else? I mean, there's a seeker room up there. Why do I feel like there was something else I wanted to come back for? Oh, it was because... Okay, yeah. Uh, it was the cancer trinket, but I can't get it. I was I had that in my brain just in case I got some sort of flight. Like I was talking about the hangman card. Uh, but no dice, unfortunately. So there's no use in going back. I mean, we could have went to the, the cursor... Or sorry, the seeker room, but... I mean, I th I, again, I still think we're, I still think we're fine. I mean, the run hasn't like completely taken off where I'm like not even having to think about doing, you know, certain things. Okay. We're running into more Curse of the Lost. We might want to pop the Sun card the next time we can, honestly, because I could see us running into some Curse of the Lost on the womb and then being shit out of luck. We just took some damage there. It was really bad. I can't seem to finish this dude. Holy hell. There we go. There we go, mate. You always want to keep that bottom poop alive before he does his first charge. Ooh, just made it back. So he bounces off of it and goes back up. Justice, might as well pop it now. Let's check this chest out here. Oh, that is sack heaven. That is sack heaven, baby. Um, moon, moon, sun. Moon, moon, sun. I mean, we have a ton of batteries there. I don't know if it's necessary to use. Ooh, in and out of that. What, what drop? Nothing. Oh, come on, you son of a bitch. I baited myself there. I was like, oh, I teased the door, and then I came back in way too hot, and the spikes got, got me. It got to me. Let's go right. Have we been here? Yeah, we have. Okay, all right. Jesus, man. Curse of the Lost, dude. I can't. I can't with the Curse of the Lost. Straight trash, homie. Straight trash, homie. Okay. Ugh. Got the arcade. There's our item room. Okay, okay. Now we're checking some things off the list. Ooh, homing shots. All right. I'll take them. 
I'll take them, baby. Unfortunately, little Brim's Brim isn't homing, but that's okay. So many batteries. Yeah, that's too far. Charge key, another battery, check out the shop. Nothing really doing, we'll just buy, you know what? Let's donate as much as we can. Jeez, man, that's such a low donation machine, holy hell. And it's not gonna get much higher after that break, pretty early break right there. What? How, how did that creep not hit me? Uh, what? Did Mini Mush save the day again, dude? Holy hell. I really don't know how the creep didn't hit me. Must have tiptoed with our small hitbox around that. Okay, definitely just want the sun card and be out of there. Oh! I was trying to pay attention on getting Little Brim, like, lodged in that little area. We're gonna miss boss rush here by like three minutes, which is okay. It's totally okay. Again, I think I, like I called this a win, but that doesn't mean it was insanely OP or anything. I don't think it is OP by any stretch. Um, I actually missed out on a uh, deal with the devil there as well. That's okay. Hopefully get a deal with the devil here on the womb one. And uh, like I said, I think I'm just gonna use the sun as soon as possible here. Oh, dude, yeah, Bloody Crown is. Okay, I'm glad I did. I'm glad I did use the uh, the sun card just to make sure that trinket was what I thought it was, and it is, kind of surprisingly. I, I thought I was maybe confusing a trinket, but let's give myself some credit, you know? I'm so bad with trinkets, so let's, I'm, I'm totally okay. I'm totally accepting of the credit that you guys are about to give me in the comments. All right. Usually I'm like, no, you know what, guys? Then you know, enjoy the enjoy the Isaacs. You know, I don't, I don't I don't deserve anything. You guys are just beautiful people, right? But nah, nah. I'll take it. I'll take it, dude. Might have just thrown the run. Nah. I like I like homing technology. Plus, we still have little brim. If we're being real, little brim is like most of our damage anyway. And. I'd like to get some use out of Bloody Crown, you know? Take take what it gives me. Take what the game gives me. But as we said earlier, the game giveth, the game taketh away. I mean, the game gave us an amazing start, and ever since then, it's just been... mediocre to maybe slightly above average. Um, I mean, we've maintained, you know? Yeah, I like me some homing uh, technology. Nothing wrong with that. Packs a bit of a punch, you know? Plus, we, we still have uh, pinking shears, so. The bosses, it doesn't even matter. They don't even stand a chance. I don't even stand a chance. We got tears up. Okay, okay. Doom, doom. All right, so we're on the uh, we're on the womb too. What? <laughs> we chill, we chill, we chill, boys, we chill. But seriously though, I think we're gonna be slightly underpowered with our technology in the womb. Uh, the womb one didn't really even count because we had mapping. Beeline to the item room and beeline to the freaking boss fight. Easy peasy, in and out. Um, yeah, I mean, we do have one guppy item. Fortunately, we didn't make that two guppy items. That is just uh, Bob's curse. Probably shouldn't have done that if I'm being real. Hopefully we get a decent item here, though. Damn. Okay, well, we found our boss, which is, you know, good, but... I do want to find our item room because you never know. It could be something great. The game hasn't been super kind to us uh, item wise. So might as well try to check. I mean, I guess, you know, shroom cap and homing shot isn't necessarily mean. Like we got to at least take some items. 
I don't know. I don't know how we got out of that, but we did. Ooh, baby. Mm, that HP up is really good. I was looking for a tin rock, didn't see one. I mean, Bob's brain re-rollable. TNT, okay, we don't really need this money, so. Um, sad bombs are good, but with like technology, that it, they're definitely not as good by a long shot. Oh, they want us to take Crooked Penny so badly. Holy hell. Um, shit, man. Fuck it. <laughs> I'm like, I'm trying to lose this at this point. I'm trying to throw. Taking technology. And now drop in pinking shears, which is our like surefire way to kill bosses. Any and all bosses, that is. It's just crooked pennies too fun and it showed its face twice, man. I gotta just take it. I gotta just take it. We still have a little brim to carry us. And our technology shot is, you know. Oh Jesus Christ, I regret everything. I regret everything. Look at how bad our tech is by itself. Like the only thing whittling uh, it lives down is is little brim. I mean, the good thing about our tech is that it is homing and it does hit basically every time we shoot it. Come on, be freaking lump of coal so I can so I can uh, take it and then do it to the pedestal. Yes. It didn't work? What is that? Why didn't it work? Oh God. Usually, doesn't it usually give you a coin if it doesn't work? That was super weird. Maybe you can't do it with Lump of Coals. Uh, I find that super weird and hard to believe, but maybe you can't do it with Lump of Coals pedestal? <laughs> Krampus pedestal? I don't know. I think uh, Lumpicole helped us out a decent amount there, actually, low-key. Yeah, we good. We Gucci, boys. Two of spades. of spades. Okay, let's check this out. Eh, not super interested in that. Dude, that, that constant hitting with, like, the decent tier rate that we have and the homing on the technology, it's, it's doing something, man. It's definitely doing something. Oh, come on. I got mini mush, dude. What do you, what do you mean? My hitbox is non-existent. Uh, I was trying to think if we could do anything cheeky. Oh, didn't I just take steam sail? Oh, I should have done it to that pedestal. God damn. It's so hard to get into that habit. I'm sorry, guys. It's hard to get into that habit. It's just foreign. Still very foreign to me. And before the roast, because I said I was getting good with Crooked Penny earlier in the episode. <clears throat> hey, the one time I did remember, it didn't even work, bro. Oh, no, not like this. We're throwing. We are throwing. We are actually throwing. <laughs> I don't even know what I tried to do there. Seriously though, we keep getting hit. This is, it's not gonna be good. I don't, I, it looked like Infamy ate that, but I don't even have Infamy. I don't know. All right. Just gotta play better. Just gotta play better. If we play better, we'll still be okay. That was interesting. It was like bouncing all around. I should have known it wasn't that way because that big room would be, you know, technically connected to more room, you know what I mean? Okay, he doesn't have much distance there, that's good. We still can't fly, which is a little bit of our issue right now. I think it's too valuable to, oh geez, to crooked, uh, Jeez, that was a dicey, dicey room. It's too valuable to Crooked Penny the chest um, on the chest because, well, first of all, we could always we could always Crooked Penny the 
pedestals, right? Or no? Did I mess it up last time? I don't even know. Hopefully his minions won't be that big of a deal. They're not. Good. Yeah, the minions went down pretty fast. That was actually a really surprising first phase. I mean, little brim and constantly hitting with this attack is is doing 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 some good things, man. I can't remember the last crooked penny play I did on the chest, and then after I did it, I was like, I should have done it this way, and I can't recall. I think I tr yeah, the last time in the chest I tried to I tried to crooked penny everything right off the bat. I didn't open anything. Okay, so what we're going to do here is go like this. If I'm not mistaken, that's going to turn them into pedestals and not chests now. And maybe we can swindle it into working. But like if I go like this and this and then I go like this. Okay, it would have worked if it hit. It didn't hit because we missed out on the 50-50 chance there. Holy balls, that was really difficult to dodge. Okay, one's dead. Half the problem's down. Curse of Darkness looks badass with the technology. The homing technology, I should say. Yeah, I mean, we completely whiffed on the Crooked Penny play, which sucks, but... And we didn't really get much help. I mean, Spelunker's hat and Little Hushy isn't great. Ooh. Okay. Oh my god. No, 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 no. Not like this. I'm just really terrified because we don't have permanent forward invincibility. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, we can hemorrhage a lot of health, man. We can hemorrhage a lot of health really quickly. And we're going into dead ends. Wow, that was a quick work of a room. Okay, again, same play. I like Common Cold and I want it, but we could try to reroll the pedestal once we take it. I kind of wanted it to work just so we... Ooh, that's really good. Uh, just so we can confirm it works. So take that. Son of a bitch. Son of a bitch. But Cracked Crown is amazing. And then Common Cold on top of that is also amazing. Turned our brim green instead of purple. Whoa. Double Gertie Jr. room and we got out alive, man. Spelunker's hat coming in the clutch. I was going to say hopefully a black heart or a soul heart. We got neither. Stars, stars, magician. I mean, we could stars card. Okay, interesting. Definitely not the best room. Not a room I really want to find myself in, but we actually mowed one down already. Let's get Hushy in there. I think he's on him. Yeah, it looked like he was on him. Oh, yes. Curse of the Maze, yes. Damn. My tech is pretty freaking strong right now. For tech one, it's kind of mowing through people. Yeah, this is going to be a W, man. It got a little sketchy. It definitely hit a speed bump. Or, I guess not a speed bump. It plateaued hard as hell. And when it, when it plateaus and doesn't really, you know, go with the game, you start to lose some health. But, you know, I don't think we got weak enough to where we were really ever in danger of actually dying and throwing. Uh, it just kind of got a little scary. But that was a powerful technology, man. It really was. Hope you guys enjoyed it. That is another W. We are at a 25 win streak. Again, like I said, hope you guys did enjoy that run. I had a good time. Technology, you know, it has a special place in my heart. I know it's not everybody's favorite, but I'm kind of a sucker for it. Hope you guys did enjoy. If you did, feel free to leave a like. Helps me out a ton. And until next time, make sure you check out the two videos listed down below. You thought I was going to forget to say it. Make sure you subscribe in the middle right there. Click the little pixely face for more Daily Isaac content. And until next time, stay safe, stay up, and here we go.
Peace out. Peace out.